So I'm just going to go through the material first. So we need an iPad, a box with a two digit lock at least. So this is three digit, but I just put a zero. And I put a little picture of a boat, which will relate to the question. So in the box, we have a UV light and a QR code. And then we have this laminated sheet of a blank, um, of an empty clock. And I said, keep me here because when they put uh, the, the hour, it will give them the direction to the key that we will need to use for this key lock. The, so a box with a key lock and then invisible message here, a small mirror. And a legend that I made, uh, which gives letters for corresponding numbers. Then we have a vase, so you just use your power of imagination because this should look uh, like a vase. <laughs> and uh, it has a message which can be read with the mirror. And then we have a mask, so when I, once again, I'm so sorry, but I have a better looking mask, but it's at school and I really wanted to post this video. And here you have you escaped. So now let's go through the beginning. So in the beginning, I just read them the backstory and I show them, uh, so I use the projector and my computer in the class and I show them a small video that I made. So it's there in the lesson plan. And this is the first math problem that they have. So they should find out a number. And what I did is I told them that uh, the iPad is the first thing to, to um, decrypt. And then we have a big box and then a small box. So I put these three on a table together. So for example, this would be the setup. I tell them that, you know, this is the first thing to crack. Then you have this box and then you have that one. So after watching the video, uh, they do some math calculation and they find out the number. The number should be 9,600. So if they open this uh, iPad, it should ask them for a code. So 9,600, and then they should see a Google Doc, which has the problem number two. And again here, when they do the math correctly, they'll have to write the answer here. So they click on here. So this is a website where they have to put the answer here, so which is 2,400 in this case. And then they will be able to view the secret message. So this is the next problem. And this problem, uh, you, they should be able to find the number 19 and this allow them to open the box and find the UV light, uh -huh. so they keep it, and the QR code. So they will uh, scan the QR code. And after scanning the QR code, they see the next problem. So this problem is to find a time. So they'll have to go to the clock. They'll have to find a place where this is in the classroom. And they will use this marker here to put what they found, which is 6.30. So if they put 6.30, it looks that, uh, it looks like it's giving them a direction towards ooh, here and they find the key to open the lock of this box. Oops, it should be closed. And when they open this, they see this. Oh, and they're like, oh, oh, that's empty. Maybe I should use the UV light, but let's find out what's there in that box as well. Okay, there is this weird thing and there is a mirror okay so what they do here is they use the uv light and they see the secret message and they crack that so uh, this will give them a number and they'll have to use this so the number is 80 and 80 is 8 v a and 0 s e Vase. Oh, so then they go to the vase and they find this, which is difficult to read, and they figure that they need to use the mirror. 
and when they use the mirror, oh my god, they can read the instruction. Which will then take them to another number, which will be 32. And it says mask. They find the mask and they look behind and they were so happy to see you escape. That's it.